Hello guys, what's going on? Welcome back to Bravely Default 2. Today we are going to be doing the Wizwald part of chapter 3, right? Nope, we're at chapter 4. Okay. Yes, let's take a rest. Right, we're at chapter 3. No, wait. We're at chapter four. I just I just forgot for a bit. Okay. Uh all right, okay. Uh no we're good. I didn't need to talk to him. I need to go outside. The enemies are still scared of me. Because I don't think they got any stronger, or in Savalon they didn't. Because I fought one dude, and he wasn't any stronger, it didn't seem. So we gotta go back up to the woods. Take this. Yes. I just want to see what job I have to do. Okay, thief. I mean, I could switch her to a bard because I'm leveled it up for her. Oh, we don't go down there. Right, that's a path we can take. Okay. Oh crap. Hold on. Go up here, I guess. And we gotta wind around. It like has only been like a week or not even since I was in this place, and I don't remember my way around it. I mean, it's kind of confusing. See, so are you gonna run away? Yeah. See, I'm gonna fight him. I wanna see how easy. I have any. Yeah. Oh yeah. Barely any. Oh. <laughs> Barely any. What the heck? Can I get up there then? I don't know. That's why I guess. Oh. So this way I guess. See what I mean? This place is confusing. We've got the walled ash branch. Now there's not anything to uh, teleport us back. So, yeah, we're just gonna not go into battle with those guys, and then, yeah, we take this, and then we can go up here, and you're gonna run away, that's right, or I'm gonna run into you almost, and then I can do that. Easy. And now we gotta go back. I like this place's music because it's like all jazzy. 
And then when you go in here, there's no music, and it's ominous. Oh, right, in here, yeah, okay. There we go. This is the branch you needed, right, Roddy? Aye, that's the one. No, I just need to cast a wee spell on it. I'll help. Roddy! I, I'm fine. Just put a bit too much of the old magical oomph into it, that's all. A wee rest, and I'll be right as rain. Well, if you say so. You take it easy, pal. You can leave the genteel to us. Oh, all right then. Sorry about this. Um, before we go, would you mind telling us how to use this thing? Oh, aye. Of course. Now, first of all, tell me, what do you know about the undead? They are beings who have transcended death, that are animated despite having died. Aye, that's about right. But there's one more important thing about them. All humans die, yes? Our lives are a journey towards death, in other words. Well, for the undead, it's the opposite. They think they're journeying from death back towards life. But what they don't realize is they'll never get there. They can't ever actually live again. So no matter how many times they're cut down, they'll get right back up, just as dead as they started. But what if we could bring them back to life? Then we'd be able to kill them, and they'd actually stay dead. Which is where the branch comes in. Aye. As you know, the Waldash is a tree full of life, literally bursting with the power to heal and nurture. And all the magic we poured into the branch has given that already impressive power a serious boost. Give Vigentio a good hiding, and then stick it in him. It might just stop him from coming back. There's no guarantee it'll work. I've never tried it before. But if I understand what Lady Emma wrote correctly, it might just be our only chance. Well, if there's anyone I trust more than you, Roddy, it's Lady Emma. It'll work. I know it will. Aye. I hope so. Now, you'd better get going. The people of Wiswold and my Lily are counting on you. Don't worry, Roddy. We won't let you down. Okay, what, what does he have to say? Rest? No. So he's basically the inn for this area. I need to go back out again. Okay. Where to this time? What's over here? I don't know if this was ever here before. I'm just gonna save. I mean, like when I was uh, leveling up in this area. When I was here. Oh. So it's the institute. The wrecked institute. Weird. Run away, boy. I don't think it was here when I was leveling up. Keep going over this way then. Probably. Yeah. And then we can. Okay, keep going over here and maybe. 
I don't know. I think this is the wrong way. Where does this take me? To the start, okay. So, how do I get there then? Do we go down here? Is there anything down here that's important? Chest. Oh, nice. I think that was like 14,000 or something. Seems like this is the only way to go. But I don't know how to get up there. Or maybe I was going the right way. Yeah, so I must have. Oh, nice and nasty surprise will emerge. What the heck? That was an insta death. What the heck, bro? But I got a large JP orb out of it. Still, though. Rude. Rude much. I guess I just better heal her. This was where we needed to be. Oh, so maybe it's down here. Nope, chest. All two medium JP orbs, nice. Maybe this will loop around or something. What the heck then? Where does it want me to go? I don't know. I really don't know.
Not likely. You let my people go or you'll regret it. No! It's not a wizard wall, you're an accident idea. I thought... No, what? I thought Ronnie was the only one of you left. We need to hurry. That guy's a real weirdo. And now we gotta curve up. Okay. Just right here. How truly fascinating! I was sure that. My deathless minions would take care of you. Either that, or you'd succumb to despair and give up halfway. But no, you've actually made it all the way here. It was quite the entertaining little sideshow, but the main event awaits. Oh, who are you calling a sideshow, pal? I can't offer any higher billing than that, I'm afraid. You'll be stacked soldiers in my undead army like all the rest once I've dealt with you. Ah, sorry, but that's no happening. You're going down, and the people of Wizwald are coming home. As a citizen of this fair nation, and a pupil of the mighty Lady Emma, I swear it. Emma was your... That bungly, foolish, brain dead incompetent! And now you intend to stand in my way just as she did! I am the Lord of the Undying, the Mighty White! You're not the least bit mighty, pal. You're a pathetic bampot who threw his toys out of the pram and ran away because he couldn't get the better of Lady Emma. you! <sighs> if you think you're making mindless minions of us, you've another thing coming. Now let's get this done. It's time for you to die and stay dead this time. Yeah. Come, let us fight! I am the greatest, mightiest wizard the world has me. ever seen! Hey, uh, what's huh? the plan? Yeah! Nice. Guess it's my turn. So, 50,000. I guess I'll heal myself. No, I'll do I have to protect myself. You rang? Okay. This should help catch up my tears. I owe you one. I must endure. Easy does it. Right. Let's see this buckle down. What's the plan? Here goes! <laughs> okay then. Okay, so we don't have a lot of health left. There you go. Well, how do you like it? My incredible power! Now that I am the mighty white, now that I have the Arcanist Asterisk, I have become the most magnificent 
mage of all! No one can stop me now! Not ever, and certainly not the pathetic apprentice! Something about that eye. Can't be true though, can it? Oh, of course it is. I'm not so sure, you know. What? What? What is happening to me? Sorry, pal. Lady Emma got the better of you again. Ah, uh, if you'd only bothered to read her work. Eesh. Smart, see? She never was one to do things by halves. Yeah, let's go. We got none. We 
items acquired is none. Let's go. That's what you like to see. They are able to... Okay, so he does dark magic. Perform a magical attack on ally and foe alike that combines the power of pa fire and water. I don't know what to say. Elvis. Everyone. Thank you. Aye, thanks so much. We'd have been done for without you. Fuck, don't mention it. As if I'd leave old Wiswold high and dry when she needed me. So, Princess Gloria, what's next? I intend to go to Holograd and recover the Wind Crystal. Then we'll come with you. After all, we've seen what they'll do to us if we don't stand up to them. And besides, you've already saved our kingdom twice. It's only right that we return the favor. Roddy, Lily, I don't know what to say. Don't mention it, Your Highness. All right, let's get a move on, shall we? To Holograd. Thank you, Roddy. Halcyonia should be our first port of call. King Vernon awaits our return. King Vernon, it's been too long, Your Majesty. Indeed it has, my dear Roddy. I have not seen you since you were made leader of your people. You have my congratulations. I had hoped that when we met again, it would be under happier circumstances than these. Prince Pollux has already arrived from Savalon. I promised that I would help Princess Gloria, and here I am. Your Highness, it's so wonderful to see you. Friends, we have all, in one way or another, come under attack by the Hologradders. Had it not been for the efforts of Princess Gloria and her friends, I doubt any of us would still have a country to call home. You give me too much credit. Now, if what we have discovered is correct, the attack on Musa three years ago was the first act of aggression in the current campaign. As we are all aware, those who attacked my kingdom that day also stole the crystals. Fire, water, wind, and earth. The power of the cardinal elements resides within each of these sacred treasures. But they are more than mere vessels. They have a far greater purpose. They are the keys that keep a great evil locked away. Many years ago, my grandfather and three comrades fought that evil, the Knight's Nexus. Who, or even what it is, I do not know. But its unleashing brought a series of great calamities upon the land. The four brave warriors faced it, each blessed with the power of one of the crystals. And after a brutal battle, the Nexus was sealed away once more. But its evil is great. Too great for even the crystals to keep in check forever. Their power must be replenished every 200 years, lest they grow too weak. And doing so was my kingdom's sworn duty. We were charged with ensuring that the crystals remained powerful enough to keep the evil contained. But then the crystals were stolen, and as their powers wane, the seal grows ever weaker. Fortunately, upon examining the three crystals we recovered, I learned that some of their power still remains. The seal it should hold brain. for a little while longer. But if we do not act now, it is only a matter of time before the Knight's Nexus is unleashed. If we are to save the world, we must stand together. The bravery of one must be the bravery of all. Halcyonia stands with you, Princess Gloria, as it always has. 
as does Savalon. It is the least we can do, after all you have done for us. I still can't quite believe my old pal's a hero of light. But I'm with you all the way, Elvis, just like I've always been. We'll teach Holograd to invade our homelands. Then it is settled. We march to Holograd on your command, Princess Gloria. Aye. I can't wait to get cracking some Holograd our heads. Long live the Heroes of Light! Long live the Heroes of Light! Long live the Heroes of Light! It's only been half an hour. Ah, so that's how you, that's what that is for. Okay. There was a purpose to it. Okay, I'm just gonna heal. Halcyonian and Savalonian forces are assembled. King Vernon and Prince Pollux await your orders. We shall create a large-scale diversion, as agreed. By engaging the enemy in combat, we hope to allow you to make your way into Holograd undetected. Good luck, Your Highness. Changed. The vanguard will engage the enemy while slowly falling back. The bulk of our remaining forces will then advance on the enemy flanks, remaining vigilant in case of ambush. We must be patient and not lose sight of our main objective, to keep the Hologradas occupied for as long as possible. Yes, Your Majesty. Hmm. Is everything all right? I am no battle commander. That was always my brother's calling. You'll be fine. Everyone's behind you. Me and my friends included. Thank you, Anihal. You do not know how much that means to me. I, um... I'd better head for the battlefield. We've got an attack to organize. Good luck, Anihal. And... be careful. Okay. 
Okay. Um, I have no idea where we are. What did you say? Near Hologram. Okay. The Halcyonians are nothing but cowards. Weaklings who allowed their kingdom to be overrun. They will fall just as easily this time. Charge! Oh! Cowards, hmm? Bold words. Though it is true that we allowed our realm to fall to another. King Vernon. But better that than condemn my people to war and needless bloodshed. To stand against a man such as Longsdale would have resulted in nothing less. We had no choice but to surrender. I will never surrender to the likes of you. Animals who have no idea what it means to be responsible for the lives of others. Your Majesty, the front line is in danger of crumbling. We must fall back and rejoin. No, this is only the beginning. We stand and fight. And besides, what better diversion than an enemy almost overrun? Here they come! Like moths to the flame! Give your all, men! This is our moment for Halcyonia! I for Halcyonia. This is pretty lit music, gotta say. Let's rip! Hit confirmed! Enemy eliminated! And there's no one moving in to replace them! Good work, everyone! Operation Muck Sweep successful. The soldiers guarding the city gates have been taken care of. Thanks, pal! We owe you one. We'll leave the rest to you lot, eh? Aye! We'll take you from here! Put the drinks on ice for the victory feast! Everyone, prepare to fall back. Time to join forces with the other armies and keep the pressure on. You can do it, Elvis. Indeed you can. Oh, there's a... 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 Haha, Saka, that's right. You do? You gotta go down here. Oh, yes. Yeah. Alright. So. Indeed, it is epic music right now. But we made it. We made it, everybody. Here we are, Holograd. Seed of the Empire. So, we finally made it into Holograd, huh? Come on, everyone. Let's go get that wind crystal. Aye. There's a lot of people out there counting on us. Indeed. Come along, everyone. So, oh, the chest is. There we go. Party chat. Okay, we got it. Go down here. No one's questioning us, that's right. Save real quick. We'll go inside. And well, let me exit. No. Wait, where am I? Holograd Army HQ. 
So I'm going to leave it off at this and we'll do this part next episode. Hope you guys have a great rest of your day and I will see you guys later. Bye.